Let's move on now to programming the pump. We'll start by programming a flow rate. Normally, when in hold, the pump will display the flow rate. If the display shows any other parameter, then press the milliliters per hour key. Then simply use the plus and minus arrow keys to change the flow rate. And press the start stop key to initiate the program. The flow rate can be set anywhere from 1 to 400 milliliters per hour in 1 milliliter increments. A feature of the pump is that it will briefly pause at common flow rates such as 50, 125, and 250 milliliters per hour. Once you've pressed the start stop key, the run circle will begin to rotate to confirm that the pump is running. The flow rate remains in the display. If you want to limit the volume delivered, you need to add one step to the process. After you've entered the flow rate, press the dose equals volume key. The abbreviation CONT will appear in the display, denoting continuous feeding. Using the plus and minus keys, enter the dose to be delivered. The range goes from 1 to 4,000 milliliters in 1 milliliter increments. Once you set the dose, press the start stop key as before. You can change the rate or the dose at any stage during feeding simply by pressing the start stop key. This pauses the pump. You can then press the relevant key, for example, dose equals volume. Then, using the plus and minus arrow, change the dose. Pressing Start Stop will resume feeding. The Info key can be pressed during operation. It will display the total volume delivered since the memory was last cleared. This information remains in the display until the keys milliliters per hour or dose equals volume are pressed. It is possible to clear any of the pump settings. Press Start Stop to place the pump in hold. Press the relevant key, for example, milliliters per hour. Once the flow rate is in the display, promptly press the CLR key to clear it. The display will return to the Flowcare Infinity's default setting. For dose, the default setting is CONT, meaning no dose is set and a continuous feed will be delivered. You can also clear the total volume delivered simply by pressing the clear key to set it to zero. Pressing and holding the CLR key for two seconds will reset all the pump parameters, including dose, total volume delivered and flow rate to their default values of CONT, 0 and 0 milliliters per hour. It's recommended that you do this with each new patient. Please note that older Infinity pumps have a default flow rate of 125. We recommend that when possible, you run the pump from mains power. The plug symbol in the display indicates when you're doing this. When running on battery power, the battery level symbol appears. The battery will normally last 24 hours when running a continuous feed at 125 milliliters per hour. The number of bars that are visible denotes the status of the battery. Each bar represents about 6 hours of battery life at an average flow rate. The battery symbol will begin to flash when there's one hour of battery life remaining. In addition, the pump will beep every 3 seconds. As soon as you can, Plug the pump into the mains to continue to run the pump and to recharge the battery at the same time. Recharging will take approximately six hours.